A subject of remembering victims of homicide tonight, Marcy Mills was shot and killed nearly 18 years ago. Today, Donna Williams speaking with Marcy's mom and joins us now live in the studio. Donna, good evening. Good evening, Ben. Very tragic story. I spoke with Martha, that's her mom, and she takes us back to the day she received a phone call that would forever change her life. She says she hopes her story will encourage parents to love on their children a little longer tonight. August 24th, 2001, on a Friday morning about 9.30, I was over there shampooing hair, and Terry called me. Inspector Nelson called me, and told me that something had happened to my daughter and I thought it was Renee and he said no it was Marcy. Marcy Mills, a mother who was shot and killed while leaving for work. Marcy's mother tells us the phone call she received changed her life for forever. So he waited for her that morning to get in her car. He shot her in the back before she got in her car and she was getting in her car and then when she fell Face down in the dirt, he came and shot her point blank in the back of the head. Martha tells WDHN, although her daughter was taken away from her many, many years ago, the pain still lingered. But, um, yeah, it's, it's, it's awful. It's awful to lose a child, especially the way mine was killed. Martha tells me grieving is forever, but finding an outlet is what keeps her going daily. I started going around and singing to people, to churches and and uh, nursing homes and stuff because she she loved my singing and uh, and I just know one day I'm going to see her again. Now Ben, as we approach National Day of Remembrance for Homicide Victim, we remember those who are still mourning the loss of their loved ones. Ben? Alright, certainly so. Donna, thanks for that report tonight. Coming up...